Hello and hi, welcome to Yedidiyashovet.net and welcome to Jewish Wisdom Week number 32. Today's question, which was addressed to the Vilna Gaon, is a very interesting question I wanted to share with you today. In short, it's basically about friendship. A person that you know, he's in a state of worry, he's sad, he's suffering. And you want to know, should I tell the guy, look... Why aren't you believing in God? Why don't you trust in the Almighty that is going to take care of you? Is this something that you should uh, refrain from doing? Or is this something you should push for? To maybe tell him that, look, if you have more emunah, if you have more belief, then none of this is going to go to a negative state, and it's going to ultimately be in a, for a good purpose. So what should you do in such a matter? Is this the correct route, the correct guide, or not? So the rabbi says something very interesting. He says, first of all, you have to understand, when a person is in a state of worry, when a person is in a state of suffering, he's also in a state of depression. Now, when he's in a state of uh, depression, what he needs is not for you to give him a lecture. What he needs from you is words of positivity, words of uh, consolation, words of uplifting his feelings. That's what he needs from you. And how can you do that? For instance, you have someone who is worried. You go to him, you emphasize with him. You share his suffering. You say that, I understand that this is horrible, I understand this is bad, I want to be there with you, I, I, I know that it's hard, but ultimately we'll get through this. So and so has gone through such an issue like this, you can get through it too. When you share and you show that, look, I care that it's not just, uh, why don't you believe uh, that everything's going to be fine? That, that's not going to work out. But when you actually share in the person, and you show them that, look, you're going to get through it. You're going to get through it. So-and-so got through it. Ultimately, it's going to be fine. You know, it's going to make the person feel a little bit more positive. He's not going to feel as if that he's uh, hopeless. And when that works out, and you see you've changed his mode, his method of thinking, then the next question should be this. Let me ask you, what have you done in the past? Or what do you think has been done in the past to get through this? And then their mind, since it's at ease a little bit, they'll, it'll start to think. And you will have that ability, and they will have that ability together in order to get through it. And then do you know what happens? He comes out of that state of depression. He comes out of that state of worry. And now he's coming and starting an uplifted state because of you. And he can now take it to the next step. All because you didn't push him, you didn't lecture him, but rather you shared with him. So the next time you see someone is down, he doesn't need a lecture. He just needs a friend. He needs someone that shows his support. And ultimately, may all of us show each other support. And I wish you a beautiful day, a day of strength to you and your friends. Amen.